Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, we are gonna be looking at another player review. But this player review is neither an SBC nor an objective. But this card, Mikhail Borga card, which was released uh, as a player in the packs. So I packed this guy, and I thought, okay, we have been focusing a lot on Europe. Uh, Europas, not Europa, my bad. Uh, we are focusing a lot on the Euros and we have not focused much on the Copa America side of Path of uh, Path to Glory. I think we did one player, uh, Copa America Path to Glory, which was, uh, if I'm not wrong, uh, Lisandro Martinez, who is uh, from Argentina. Now, Colombia are in the finals as well, so it is only fair if we review a Colombian player as well. This is Miguel Borga, 95 rated striker card. Now, without any further ado, let's get into this video. We are going to be looking at his stats, his attributes, his uh, play style, his weak foot, his uh, work rate, all of those things. And once we look at that, we are going to be putting him in a squad and we're going to be seeing how he is in game, whether the stats are true to the card, which are on paper and whether they are true in game as well or it's just a hype or not we'll actually look at that now first off five star weak foot and five star skill move is not there in this card it's a four star and four star for skill move and weak foot and he has a, a high working uh what is that work rate for attacking and a low defensive work rate usually many people have medium but because he's a striker i think it's low defensive work rate but he still has 50 to defend which is not bad for a striker and uh, I don't know how many of you guys know he plays for Comnable Libertadaros I don't know if I butchered that but yeah he plays for River Plate or however they pronounce his second name now looking at his stats which is which is very very eye catching not gonna lie 99 pace 97 shooting 90 dribbling and 96 physical so these are the four stats which I always look when I select my striker now shooting and pace and physical are out of this world and when you look at dribbling and ball control under dribbling it's a bit low i'm not gonna lie it is a bit low but uh, we will use him in game and see how it is because the card which we reviewed yesterday which was Connor gallagher he also had low acceleration but he was really good in game so maybe it's the same thing with this card as well but looking at the stats in detail he has 99 finishing he has 99 short par he has 90 long shot these stats are insane 99 attacking position 97 penalties guys and he has 99 99 for attacking and i mean acceleration and sprint speed this is actually insane and like we said in, un in under dribbling he has 91 ball control and he has uh, 89 dribbling i am guessing once we put him in the team if he gets full camp he might be getting some plus over there so we'll see how it is when we add him in the team and looking at defense and physical he has 99 heading accuracy and 99 jumping and he has 99 strength as well and 96 stamina these stats look really really good guys that is one main reason which i wanted to do the a review for this card because many will not be knowing about the card like this and i don't know how many of you guys are using this card if you guys have got this card so I thought, okay, it's only fair to do a review on this guy. Uh, so yeah, and looking at his going to his play style, he does have four play style pluses, which is actually really nice to see. He has finesse shot play style, he has power shot plus play style plus, he has pinch pass and low ball pass play style, uh, he has technical rapid plus flare and first touch, which are really good. He has Trivela as well, Trivela plus he has. Yes, quick step and aerial. Oh, aerial plus he has. So he is going to be good in air, guys. Uh, we have to try that. I don't know how to try that, but we'll try our best to try that. Now we'll put him in a team and then we'll see how he is in game. Now the main stats that we're going to be testing are a shooting, his pace, his dribbling. Apart from that, I don't think we need to test anything else for a striker. So yeah, let us actually get, put him in a team and see how he is in game. Okay, now put him in my team. He doesn't get full camp uh he doesn't get full cam but it is okay he gets two cam which gives him plus two in uh, ball control and plus two in dribbling i will see how he does this we'll see how he does i think even if he gets full cam he'll get like plus three or plus four which doesn't make a lot of difference i guess i will just see how he is in game like i said we'll test out his shooting we'll test out his dribbling and then we'll test out his pace the main three things 
we need to test it out and physical is also important for a striker but i don't know how we'll test out a physical for a player review but we'll test out the first three things that i told uh, spoke about and we'll see whether he's actually good in game whether it is if you guys have him whether you should be using him if you guys haven't got puskas yet puskas is amazing i don't know how many people missed out on puskas but if you have if you guys haven't got puskas or if you guys haven't got a better uh, striker and if you happen to have broha uh, borha i don't know uh, whether you want to use him or not this video might help you guys so yeah make sure you guys watch till the end and let me know how the video was in the comment section as well will help me out a lot if you guys want me to do more player reviews like this uh, players who are not in sbc or in objective and are just players who we packed from pack opening i am down to do that i have a bunch of players uh, that i want to do he has really good pace i'm not going to lie he has he has really good pace like pace is out of this world his shot par is insane guys uh shot par when the ball leaves his feet it goes at a speed that you can't even look at properly it's so fast now the ball control is pretty decent now i don't know the ball control was the one which was low rated right it is actually pretty decent it sticks to his feet a lot if i don't do unnecessary uh, turns and you know all those things he is able to give the ball to his feet more than i actually thought he would be able to but so far pace is actually out of this world 99 pace is pretty much uh, I don't know what is happening to me. Why am I losing the ball over there? This is the highest rated team I've played so so far in any of the player reviews in all of the player reviews combined. This is the highest rated team I've played so far. So it is going to be hard for me. We have conceded a goal, but conceding a goal will help us to start off with uh, Borja. So he has really good pace guys, not gonna lie, his pace is really good. Dribbling is actually decent, I feel ball control is where we must focus on, but dribbling so far is good. I know I said ball control is good as well, but dribbling is a bit better than that. Shooting is really good, like there, the goalie, this Cassius is doing a very good job. But otherwise, if it was any other goalie other than Cassius, I'm guessing it's going in, going to go in. But uh, yeah, the the shooting is really good. He is really good. He is really good. The pace is too good, guys. The pace is too good. I am in love with the pace. I don't know why I'm playing so bad when it comes to finishing. It's just I I'm overdoing it a bit too much. Like I feel like any other person who plays this game will be able to utilize him really well I don't know, I am just bad at this game look at that, with the gap he's able to find I am trying to shoot from weird positions to try and test if it's going on target it is going pretty much on target at least 90% of the time uh, but when I give a bit too much power it just goes off but up, according to me, shooting is really good and pace is like I don't even have to talk about pace. Dribbling is really good as well. You know, finally, we got a goal, a goal with him. Uh, I would say finishing is really good as well. And uh, what else we thought? Dribbling. Let's. Uh, we played for 42 minutes of in-game time. I think we can come to a conclusion with to this card. Uh, pa uh, pace is out of this world, guys. I am very happy with the pace. Now, dribbling is also very good. Ball control might be a very minute issue. But it's not. It's not something crazy that you guys will be like okay i'm not going to be able to play with this player it's not that big of a deal you can play with this with them really well and four star skill move when you get the ball from your midfield or defense he is able to uh, juke the defense of your opponent and he's able to take the ball away from them through a skill and then push it to the place where he can take it and attack with the ball so that is really good as well is uh, dribbling ball control we spoke about it's decent not bad it is uh, not great but it is decent you can play with him and you can actually do some damage to the opponent as well but coming to shooting 
I feel like the shot power is amazing. Finishing is really good. Now the attacking position that he has 99. I don't know if it's 99, you know, it should be like 95, I'm guessing. It's not great, but it's not bad. Like CM like dribbling. It's not great, but it's not bad. Uh, apart from that, I don't see why you shouldn't be using this card. It's a really good card. You might get unlucky like that shot you just saw there. But apart from that, look at the pace. Look at the pace. He's able to take the ball and run like a madman, you know. He is really good. Finish uh, Short part is really good. Finishing is also really good. I don't know what else we need to look at it. But uh, I think this is a good card. If you guys do have him, make sure you use him. Because at least for one or two games, and you'll get an idea of how he is. But apart from that, I think much to talk about this card. I'll see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Hope you guys hope you guys found this informative. At least one percent or two percent. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next uh, video. I don't know what it's gonna be, but until next time, guys, take care, stay safe, stay motivated, and keep money. Bye bye.